Well, this is truly unforgiving terrain. It's currently um, blowing about 50 to 60 knot wind. It's absolutely hideous. Uh, and there are a big group of uh, red deer stags just up on the hill there. And as you can see, the, the large group of uh, red deer stags there, they just don't seem to be fussed by the weather whatsoever. Just uh, built to survive. Absolutely magnificent. I've just arrived and uh, it's now started snowing. Awesome. Um, beautifully quiet in here. Yeah, snow on the ground. So I'm here now at uh, Mar Lodge Estate. Uh, just a little flurry of snow and now I'm going to head up into the hills now see if I can uh, track down some red grouse maybe a couple of mountain hare if I go high enough maybe even a ptarmigan but to be honest this trip wasn't really designed to be high altitude stuff really um, we need all the kit, my crampons and everything else poles but uh, originally it was going to be that type of trip, but uh, my family, my wife was able to get time off work, so we made it a bit of a family holiday instead of uh, a six day one for me. But uh, nevertheless, I'm off on my own for a, for a bit. So let's get up there, enjoy the scenery and see what's about. at the moment just in one of the glens and there's a huge huge herd of deer all stags got to be in excess of I don't know maybe 70 or 80 absolutely superb to see such a large group Magnificent group, absolutely superb. 
won't go any closer than this because I don't want to spook them all over the hill. But, uh, oh, fantastic. What a beautiful, beautiful group of chaps. Yeah, amazing. Absolutely amazing. And now the rut's over, it's uh, stags get back together again and until October, but there are, there's a bit of behaviour going on, a bit of chasing each other around a bit, and a bit of dominance still, but uh, oh, fantastic to see. Awesome, what a setting, what an absolute setting. Gorgeous. Well, the most amazing thing just happened. I've just been walking around the corner um, and rather than just keep looking ar around, I've been looking up just in case and seen two, two golden eagles um, just soaring overhead. Uh, absolutely superb. I mean, that's like the second time I've ever seen the goldies um, before. So yeah, awesome. I've got a, sh uh, a shot, um, obviously really, really far away. But you can make out on the back that they are uh, they are golden eagles. So uh, yeah, what a pleasure! What an absolute pleasure to see them. Never thought in a million years I'd see them here. Um, you know, today because it's like a needle in a haystack. But uh, yeah, that's uh, that's made my day. Now I think I'm going to call it a day. It's been uh, it's been superb. The weather's been awesome. Um, I've seen some um, some great bird species. Um, golden eagle today, two of. I managed to do a bit of handheld footage um, video and a couple very distant shots of two golden eagles going over the top. So really, really pleased with that. Um, seen quite a lot of uh, mountain hare. Though no pictures, I'm afraid, um, kind of eluded me today. But I've got a nice couple of shots of some, uh, some red grouse, which was, which was really good. Um, and I actually got some pictures of some stone chats, which is kind of bizarre, but uh, that was great to see. Um, but all in all, it's been a great day. I'm going to head home now for a nice, uh, nice cuppa. And uh, last day tomorrow. Not sure what's on the cards, but uh, no doubt I'll get out again maybe for a couple of hours and um, see if I can get some, some maybe some crossbill um, or maybe brambling and some red pole maybe if I've time but uh, yeah it's been an awesome day what a way to finish two goldies absolutely superb It's absolutely amazing. Just heard it. I don't know if you heard that then. Black grouse calling. 